It's time for another episode of Muscle and Fitness Raw. I'm your host, Dr. Jim Stepani. And in this episode, I'm going to discuss the difference between dips to target the chest and dips to target the triceps. Regular viewers of Muscle and Fitness Raw know that I like to use multi-joint exercises because they allow you to go heavier and place more overload on the muscles, which can lead to greater muscle growth in the long run. Dips make a great multi-joint exercise for the chest or for the triceps, as long as you know how to do these exercises properly to target each muscle. When it comes to doing dips for chest, use a wider than shoulder width grip on the dip bar. Be sure to bend your legs at the knees and push your legs back as far as possible. This turns your torso more horizontal and helps to place greater emphasis on the chest. When you lower your body, allow your elbows to flare out to the sides more. Stop when your upper arms are about parallel with the floor. Going any lower than that will only stress the shoulder joints and won't add much to your chest growth. Be sure to focus on contracting your pecs as you press up and flex them hard at the top without locking out your arms. Using these critical tips when you do dips will help you use more of your chest and less of your shoulders and triceps. When it comes to doing dips for triceps, the body mechanics are pretty much the opposite of what you want to do for the chest. For starters, you should use a grip no wider than shoulder width. And be sure to keep your body as vertical as possible. You can accomplish this by keeping your legs straight down below you. This will keep your body more upright and place better emphasis on the triceps. When you lower your body, keep your elbows tucked into your sides and pointing behind you. But just like you should do with dips for chest, lower your body only until your upper arms are parallel with the floor. And of course, focus on the triceps when you push yourself back up and flex them as hard as you can in the top position, locking your arms out. Using these tips when doing dips for triceps will ensure that you focus mainly on the triceps while minimizing the focus on the chest and shoulders. Where you do dips in your chest and triceps workouts depends on your strength. If you cannot do 10 reps with your own body weight on dips, then do them at the beginning of your chest and tricep workouts when your muscles are the strongest. This will help you build up more strength on dips. Once you can do 10 or more dips with your body weight, you can move them to later in your workouts after the major pressing exercises, which would be bench presses, incline presses, and dumbbell presses for chest, and close grip bench presses for triceps. You can even finish your chest and tricep workouts with dips to really burn out the muscles. If you can do more than 10 reps with your own body weight on dips, Feel free to add weight by using a weight chain or a weight vest. So be sure to use dips in your chest and triceps workouts. And of course, be sure to look for more great tips like this on other episodes of Muscle & Fitness Raw right here at MuscleAndFitness.com.